Ah. I'm trying to sleep. I know, it's these stupid touchscreen controls. I'll keep it down. Ah, I died again. How much longer? I'm sorry, just another two to three hours. I'll get it eventually with these stupid touchscreen controls. Is this you? Are you tired of playing games on your phone with crappy touchscreen controls? Ah. Uh, yeah. Then you need a backbone. Hey. Not that kind of backbone. The Backbone One controller transforms your smartphone into a next-gen gaming device. It stretches out and snaps directly into your iPhone or Android without any charging, updates, or other tedious setup. Just snap and go. Plus, you can use the Backbone app to discover amazing mobile games that'll make the most of your controller. The Backbone is great for intensive mobile games like Genshin Impact. But it's not just good for mobile games. Stream your console games via Xbox Cloud Gaming, PS Remote Play, or Steam Link. I'm playing Baldur's Gate 3. You're romancing a starian, aren't you? You know it. Yeah, you are. Can you at least do that someplace I can't hear you? The Backbone acts as the perfect controller with strong clicky buttons and stiff, but not too stiff, joysticks. Use your Backbone to play games wherever you want, whenever you want. <laughs> whenever you want is subject to change. Yeah. So click on my link in the description below or scan the QR code up here or visit playbackbone.com to pick up a Backbone One controller today. Those people down there look like they're in trouble. Incoming! Ah! <laughs> Gotta admit, that was pretty cool. But no time to dwell on that. I got ya! <sighs> hey, you two all right? I appreciate the help back there. No problem. I don't need any reward or anything. Though I am kind of hungry. Ooh, I'll take that. Morning, fellas! Time to wake up! What the hell of a wake-up call? Oh, damn it! What the hell is that? Gotcha! Huh, well, aren't you cute? That I did. What the heck are you? A sentient leaf? Huh? You're not Hestu. Hess who? Yeah, that's not me. My name's Link. But you can see me? Yeah. I didn't know your kind could see the children of the forest. What do you mean, your kind? Well, if you run into Hestu, please return this to him. Sure, I can do that. What do you got? What is this? <laughs> ah! Ah! Ha, really? Come on! Oh, another one of these towers. Maybe I can find out where I am and where I need to go. I think I got turned around. Ah, oh, crap! Another one of those! No! No! Well, this is gonna be difficult. This could not get any worse. Oh, it can get worse! Must climb faster. Just gonna move away from that guy. Can't see me over here. Oh, come on! Ah! Whoa, you're a bigot. Bring it on! You want some of this? Ah. Ah. Oh, cool. <laughs> and I was just starting to breathe well again. Ah, hello there. The end is here. Uh, say what now? I may be somewhat used to seeing bad omens by now, but that... Well, let's just say it's badder than most. You're telling me I'm the one who has to go kill the damn thing. We're doomed! <laughs> Thanks for the vote of confidence. I mean, don't panic. Good save. Sorry, who are you? Have we met? I'm the guy who's gonna save us all, whether I want to or not. Apparently it's kind of my destiny. Uh, it doesn't matter who you are, really. Rude. I was getting tired of talking to myself, so you come at a good time. Eh, I've got a world to save, but I can take a few minutes. What's up? By the by, those strange things that popped out of the ground, did you see them? Yeah, if you eat them, you smell colors, man. I do not suggest it. I'm not talking about mushrooms here. I'm talking about those towers! Oh, those. I've seen those up close and very personal. <laughs> ah, ah. Ah, who's got the big stick now? <laughs> come out, come out. Ah, ah. Why do I keep doing this to myself? Ah. Come on. Nope. Come on. That was worse. 
Come on. Nailed it. Ah, oh, place to rest, finally. I could use some not me cooked food. Man, it's nice in here. Hi there. Hey, I don't believe I've made your acquaintance. Link, and you are? The name's Beetle, but you can call me. Actually, let's just stick with Beetle. Gotta keep that alternate identity a secret, I get you. But even if you forget my face, you can remember me by my beetle shaped backpack. Oh, don't worry, I could never forget that nose. Uh, that backpack. Yep. <coughs> I've got the scoop on Misko's treasure, and it's great. Listen up, Dak. Treasure? Briston, hang on. Oh, hey, guys. Hey, buddy, what's your problem? Nothing, really. You aren't being incredibly rude and listening to our conversation, are you? Uh, no? We're treasure hunters on the trail of our latest score. Which score is that exactly? The treasure of the Great Bandit Misko. It's as good as ours. Preston, you're gonna give it all away. Sorry, Dak. I got carried away. Oh, well, that's okay. I could help you know. Anyway, we're busy here, dude. If you need something, take it up with someone else. Yeah, sure. No problem. Good luck, you two. If I find it first, I'll let you know. I'm tired of walking. I'm getting a horse. Come here! Out of the way, Blobby! I gotcha. I gotcha. I gotcha! Whoa! Whoa! Calm down. There you go. Good boy. Whoa, horse! Whoa! Sorry about that. He's new to walking, apparently. Whoa. You look nice. My favorite part about traveling is finding new fashion in the places you visit. I love discovering new looks. Oh, that's cool. I'm not much for fashion, as you can probably tell by the everything that I'm wearing. Where can I go for something new? Like, if you keep taking this path north, you'll wind up in Kakariko Village. They have some of my favorite clothes ever. Oh, good. I was heading there anyway. I'll pick up something new. Thanks for the tip. I'd be there right now if I hadn't already blown my last few rupees on this stunning neckerchief. It is stunning. Must be why my horse can't walk straight. Whoa, what the heck? Shalaka? Uh, no. Link. And you are? You. You can see me? I mean, you're pretty big, no offense. Kind of hard not to see you. Shalaza, shalaka! Okay. Is seeing you something abnormal? It's been 100 years since anyone's been able to see me. Oh, wow. Must be the mushrooms. Anyway, hi, I'm Link. I'm Hestu, and I need your help. Hestu? Huh. Sounds familiar. But sure, how can I help? Those monsters over there stole my beloved maracas. Maraca theft? I won't stand for that. Where are they? I think they're still on the other side of those rocks. Ooh, it looks like there's quite a few of them. Are you sure you need those maracas? I can't use my powers without them, Shoko. Oh, that sucks. So please, please get my maracas back from them. Not a problem. I'll be right back. And then you can shake the night away or whatever it is you do. Let's get musical. Ah, I love watching them fly. Maracas. I'm back. Shalakala, those are... Those are my maracas! Please give them to me! Whoa there, settle down. Here you go. Shalaka! But wait, there's something wrong with my maracas. I didn't do it. I mean, what's wrong with them? The Korok seeds inside are gone! How am I supposed to dance now? Shoko... If I had just one Korok seed, I could sing, dance, and use my powers to help you. Any clue where the seeds went? But wait. What? Do you have a Korok seed? Maybe. You do! You got a Korok seed from one of the forest children! Oh, right! That guy! Here you go! You sure that's a seed, by the way? Doesn't smell like a seed. Shalaka! Oh, yeah! Shaky Shaka! Say, man, what does that mean? That's quite the dance. You even added a little fireworks display. That's cute. Da -na -na -na. Weird conversation. See you, tree man. Make sure to watch out for squirrels and men with axes. Ah, we made it. Hi there. 
Okay then. Hmm. Let's go see if we can find that lady the old man told us to talk to. Ooh, I could also pick up some new threads. Suppose I can make a quick detour. Uh, yeah. What can I get for 12 rupees? Some socks, maybe? Hmm. This place looks important. You there! Who are you? How dare you trespass upon Lady Impa's abode? Uh, my name's Link. I was told to come here by an old ghost king. Hmm. Yeah, it sounds crazy. Let me start over. I woke up in a cave and found this weird thing. Is that a Sheikah slate? Oh, this? Yeah, I think that's what it's called. But that would mean you are... Link? No, it's not possible. Can it be? The one and only, I think. I don't know. I don't remember much. Oh. Please forgive us for behaving so rudely. All good. So you've heard of me? Of course, we have heard the legends from Lady Impa herself. Legends? Damn, I must have been really cool back in the day. Please, friend, go ahead and step inside. Thanks, fellas. I'm actually gonna go grab some sleep, and then I'll be back first thing in the morning. It's been a long day. Hope she's up. Oh, there's someone here. Hi there. A man? I think so. Last time I checked, at least. Huh? Is that? A joke? Yes. It's a Sheikah slate. Oh, this. Found it in a cave I woke up in. Could you be the hero my grandmother told me about? What was his name? La... Lin? Um... Link? Oh, it's not that I forgot. I'm just bad with speaking. Oh, I'm sorry. As for me, my name is Pa... 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 It's all right. Oh, my name is Paya. Well, I'm Link. Great to meet you, Paya. I cut it out. Good job. High five? No? Okay. I know I should be able to say that easily, seeing as how is my own name and all. Don't be so hard on yourself. Heck, I have amnesia and talk to ghost kings. I can't judge. I'm so sorry. Yeah, you get used to it. Anyway, my grandmother's been awaiting your turn ever since I was little. Oh, then I better not keep her waiting. Please, please hurry inside. Will do. See you around. Hello! Link is here! So... You're finally awake. Uh, it's pretty early and I haven't had any coffee yet, so not really. It has been quite a long time, Link. I am much older now. So you remember me, don't you? Uh... What is the matter? Oh, nothing! Just trying to remember that time we did the thing, you, you know. You are looking at me as though I am a stranger to you. Those eyes, they lack the light of familiarity. No, 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 maybe. It is I, courageous one. Impa, surely you must at least remember the name Impa. I know of it. Oh. I see that you have lost your memory. I know my name is Link. I used to be a legend or something, and that's about all I got. Well, it matters not. In fact, that may actually be a blessing in disguise for the time being. Says you. Dearest Link, please, come a bit closer. Okay, you don't bite, right? <laughs> I kid, but seriously. A hundred years ago. A hundred? Yes, a hundred years ago, the kingdom of Hyrule was destroyed. Oh, I know about that one, too. Ghost King, don't ask. After you fell, Princess Zelda's final wish was to place you in a sacred slumber. Yeah, I totally died. And then, all alone, alone, she went to face Ganon. Brave. Stupid, but brave. Before Princess Zelda went to nobly meet her fate, she entrusted me with some words she wished to say to you. Ooh, did she bequeath me all her treasure and money? I have been waiting 100 years to deliver the princess's message. Come on, treasure. Come on, treasure. However, yeah. these words, which the princess risked her life to leave you, while if you are to hear them, you must be prepared to risk oh. your life as well. Yeah, I've been risking it on a constant basis since I woke up, so sure, let's have it. But... 
I am afraid that burden may be too much to bear while you are still without your memories. Oh, come on. I leave the choice to you. When you feel you are ready to receive the princess's message, return to me. <sighs> all right, I'm going to go do some stuff and maybe get a bigger backpack for all that treasure. Yeah? All right, I'll be back. Can't believe I convinced them to buy all that crap I picked up. Yeah. Now I'm looking good. Hey, Paya, I'm back. All right, Impa, I'm ready now. Not a memory to your name. Hey, you are as intent as ever to charge forward with only courage and justice on your side. And about a dozen weapons, that helps. You have not changed a bit. Once a hero, always a hero. Yeah, what can I say? So what did Zelda want to tell me? Yeah. Very well. Oh. Be the four divine beasts. That is what she said. Four divine beasts, got it. You are Princess Zelda's only hope. And Hyrule's as well. Well, I'll do my best. No promises, though. You cannot turn back now. Follow your heart and seize your destiny. I'm gonna go seize me some more weapons first. Uh, it occurs to me I should have asked what the four divine beasts are. I keep forgetting that I don't know anything. Hopefully someone can point me in the right direction. Oh, girl. If anything wakes these things up, I am so screwed. Please don't wake up. 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 Please don't what the? What the heck is this stuff? Whoa! The moon ain't looking so hot. What? Link. Yes? Be on your guard. Pretty much always on my guard. Ganon's power grows. It rises to its peak under the hour of the blood moon. Well, crap. By its glow, the aimless spirits of monsters slain in the name of the light return to flesh. Oh, come on! Link, please be careful. This quest sucks! Well, couldn't get much worse, I suppose. Hi there. You might want to get inside. There's monsters about and such. I can tell you've trained your body well. Uh, thanks? You coming on to me? I'd say you're familiar with both sword and bow, correct? I have them, if that's what you mean. That's a good skill set. Why don't you join the Yaga clan? What's the Yiga clan? That a cult? Uh, what? You don't know? It's kind of a running theme in my life right now. Fine, I'll tell you. The Yaga clan. It's... Definitely sounds like a cult. A powerful, brave group of warriors founded by Master Koga and dedicated to defeating a hero thought long dead. Oh, that sounds great. Well, you have fun with that. I have to, um, go. I will huh? take your life. Ah, damn it. Come on. Not only do I have to kill Ganon and four giant beast things, but now a cult? Come on. Oh, and in. Thank God I can get out of this rain. Oh, that's nice. Welcome. Hi there. Thanks for coming here in the rain. Thanks for letting me in. It's really coming down out there. Welcome to Tan Pu Inn. It's a lovely place you've got. Do you have any rooms I can rent for the night? A regular bed is 20 rupees. Or if you're looking for a more relaxing and restorative mind and body experience. Uh, what kind of inn is this? You can have one of our extra soft, downy beds for 40 rupees. Oh. Hmm. Oh. This should be the place Impa told me could help me out. Hi there. Um, little girl? Hello. Uh, hi. Where am I exactly? This is the Hoteno Ancient Tech Lab. Do you have some business with the director? Yes, I was told to see them. The director's in the back. Okay, thanks. A terribly busy person, that one. Please try to keep it brief. Will do. Weird. Excuse me. Hello. Ah. Hi there, whoa. That is a lot of books. I imagine you've never seen so many books in one place. Not that I know of. Pretty incredible, isn't it? Incredible's a strong word. Mm. Is that the thing on your waist? What, do I have a spider on me? Get it off! Is that a Sheikah? There's no mistaking it. That's a real Sheikah slate, isn't it? Oh, oh yeah, okay, thought it was a spider. Yeah, it's a Sheikah slate. Ah, where are my manners? I nearly forgot to introduce myself. No big deal, everyone just seems distracted by what's on my waist. I take it as a compliment. My name is Simon. 
You, uh, Link, right? How does everyone seem to know who I am but me? Lady Impa caught me up to speed. Ah, Director, listen, Miss Director, this is a real Sheikah slate. Director? Wait. Sheikah! You sly little... You lied to me. <laughs> Are you surprised? Yeah, very little surprises me anymore after a statue nearly blasted my face off. You don't look like you changed a bit in the last hundred years, but something must have happened in all that time. What do you mean? Were you there? Are you over a hundred years old? Jeez, what fountain of youth are you drinking out of? Blinky, what did that look? Oh, sorry, my face just kind of does that now after the statue explosion. You do still remember me, right? Uh... No? Hmm, as expected. You expected this? You could have left me a note or something, so I wasn't out of the loop. After 100 years in the summer of restoration, Subject has lost all memories. Noted! What are you doing? Oh, sorry. I have a bad habit of taking notes rather abruptly like that. It's a charming quirk, isn't it? That's one way of putting it. Weird girl, lady, witch, thing. But at least she gave me a cool camera to take pictures with. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, bet this stuff will taste good with some toast. Huh. Why does this seem so familiar? Hmm. Oh, right. Princess Zelda took a photo here. With... me? Was I here? I think? From here, we'll make our way to Goron City. Mm-hmm. Then, we'll need some adjustments on that divine beast so Daru can manage it as easily as possible. Mm -hmm. He's figured out how to get it to move. However, it's apparent that we still have much more to learn. Mm -hmm. But to think, that divine beast was actually built by people. Mm -hmm. That means we should be able to understand how it works and how to use it to our advantage. Mm -hmm. These divine beasts... So much we don't know. But if we want to turn back Calamity Ganon, they're our best hope. Mm-hmm. Oh, sorry. I wasn't paying attention. What's up, Z? You all right? Tell me the truth. How proficient are you right now wielding that sword on your back? I haven't cut myself today, Legend so... Legend says that an ancient voice resonates inside it. There is? Can you hear it yet, hero? Yeah, thank God. I thought I was going crazy. <gasps> Whoa. I remember that so clearly now. That was just one conversation. How weird. I wonder if I find more places like this if I'll remember everything. Whoa, what the hell? It's one big fruit. I could eat for weeks. Now how do I cut this thing open? Boy! Yeah, the plant talks! Sweet boy! And it wants to eat me! I think. Please, listen to my story. Oh, uh... Sure? I am the great fairy Kotera. A fairy? Weird. Didn't think fairies would look like plants. This place was once a beautiful spring. But as time passed, Fewer and fewer travelers arrived to offer me rupees. As a result, my power has abandoned me. So your power comes from money. Sounds convenient for you. Less so from my money pouch. I'm nearly powerless now, so I beg your help. I need rupees to become whole again. Sounds about right. How much do you need? All I need is a hundred rupees. Freaking what?! A hundred rupees? Do you know what a hundred rupees could buy me? Once my power has been restored, I can help you do great things, boy. Ah, <sighs> sure you can. What's a plant gonna do for now, me? Yeah! If you have rupees, hand them over to me, quickly. Yeah, okay. Hello? Yeah! Thank you. You are too kind. Sure, no problem. Just don't crush me. 
It's overflowing. You all right? Ah, whoa. What the hell? Fairy plant lady, you okay? Uh -huh. Holy jeez! You are a lot of woman, fairy thing. <sighs> you all right after all that? Oh, what a feeling! That first breath of fresh air after an eternity of decay. It's just so intoxicating. Air doesn't really do that for me. Ale, on the other hand. Thanks to you, I've been returned to my former glory. And what a glory it is. And as they say, one good turn deserves another. I can help you, boy. Okay. Allow me to enhance your clothing. It's the least I can do, but I will need the necessary materials. Oh. Thanks for that. See you later. See ya. hi -ya! Best 100 rupees I've ever spent. At least I think. Maybe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's right. <laughs>